I will now take you guys to the other end of St. Thomas, up Sturgis side, close to Harrison's Cave, now that's my whole gully. Side of St. Thomas. Here's the basin that is filled with water. We are looking across the King and Field and Mount Misery, which is in the parish of St. Thomas. This road leads back to King and Field. And we'll come this way and go back. Yes, we're looking back at Mount Misery. We are from the telephone company antenna and substation. That's it. This is Key and Field Road. Now take you back to the Vault Road and Sturges. This road leads to the Vault Road, Sturges, West Mohawk Gully, Harrison's Cave, and back to Highland Road as well. Mm -hmm. okay, this is the entrance to Highland. This world is about the Harrison Cave, Watch Mahogany, the Vault Road, Highland Road, about the Sturges, Carrington's Village, and Chapman's Village, or in the parish of St. Thomas. Now approaching Highland Road, that takes you back to the Vault Road. This is the area where the helicopter crashed. Back in 1992, killing and maiming all who were on board. I wasn't born yet, but my mother and my mother and aunts and so on told me stories about it, about the um, helicopter that crashed. They told me about the helicopter that crash in 1992, just at the end of the Vault Road, taking it back to KM3 and Highland Road. This is this area, this stretch here. Highland Road in the parish of St. Thomas. Now approaching the Vault Road, Harrison Cave, which my heart really as well. Yeah, yeah. Here's his land where he keeps his cows. We got some Carl Williams cows here at Highland Road. Carl Williams cows 
at Sunshine Crew at Highland St. Thomas. This road, this track here leads back to Highland, the other end of Highland, across the line of Castle. So, So back to Harrison Skiff, where it's my hard belly, and this is the road with a helicopter crash back in 1992, killing and maiming all those who were on board. As I said before, St. Thomas is a beautiful Highland parish with hillside, with hill formations resembling those of Portland and St. Anne Parish in Jamaica. It also has hill formation like the Scotland district here in Barbados as well, which comprises of the parish of St. Andrew and St. Joseph. They refer to the Scotland district because it resembles the Scotland countryside. So, you know, Highland Road, this is that area where the helicopter crash. Yes, guys. Approaching the Vault Road, St. Thomas. But I'm approaching the other end of the Vault Road, the end that leads you back to Carrington's village. St. Thomas is my parish, first of all, where my family come from. My mother said the family is from the Vault Road and Carrington's village. I'll show you that village where my mother, where my grandparents and my aunts were born. And my uncle, one of my uncles as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes, guys. Highland Road in St. Thomas. Approaching the Vault Road Junction. This is Top Speed Corner. They refer to it as Top Speed Corner because there was a guy li living in the area by the name of Top Speed. And he was riding his motorcycle at Top Speed. And he fell off his bike and hurt himself somewhere around this area here. That's why he referred to as Top Speed Corner. A portion of Mahogany, St. Thomas. This is now the Vault Road. The ever end of the Vault Road, the Vault Road, Carrington's Village Junction. It's straight ahead, we'll take you back to Carrington's Village. And this road here is the Vault Road that takes you back to the Williams Vault and back to Rechma Hall, Main Road. And this is Carrington's Village. In St. Thomas, where my great aunts, my aunts, my grandparents, my grandmother, my great grandparents were born, and one of my uncles in this area. All my 
Grant, my mother is lying. My grand my mother and my father is lying. All behind you. This is Carrington's village in St. Thomas. And this area gives awesome views of the East Coast as well. Parishes of St. Andrew and St. Joseph, which are best referred to as the Scotland district of Barbados. You can see the parishes of St. Andrew and St. Joseph. And this is all the gully here. And this is the Scotland district here. All Carrington's village in St. Thomas. This is the rear end of the vault road here. Where my family come from. This is the, the, the rear end of the vault road. The road ahead of me, above me, is the vault road. And this road beneath here, below here, is Carrington's Bridge, St. Thomas. I'm taking you to the northern entrance to Welchman Hall Gully. When you park your cars, you pay to enter the gully, you get your souvenir, you buy your souvenirs, and you pay for your little refreshments. All up here, all Carrington's Village, St. Thomas. St. Thomas is in the center of the island, but this part of St. Thomas is close to the parish of St. Andrew and St. John. The sun here saying about Shmahal Gali. This is the northern entrance, the main entrance. I hear the sun showing the sites of interest in Barbados. Some of them. A lot of characters in village. This is the former viewpoint bar, which is the characters village in Thomas. It has been closed since 2013. The last it was open, it was closed because there was a shooting here. Since there was a shooting here, and somebody died as a result, it never opened back. Yes, it's Carrington's village, St. Thomas, looking at the viewpoint bar and the northern entrance to Rex Mahogany. This is, this is all about Shimahal Gali here, which is the Gali and tropical forest and reserve. Yeah, yeah. That's good. This is Carrington's village in the parish of St. Thomas. This is my village, my family village. Where my family from my mother's side originate from, where they were born. My mother, my mother, my aunts, my great aunts, my uncles and great uncles and so were born. Yeah, Stacy. Hey, good. And this is the Carrington's Assembly Hall. My great grandparents were the founders of this church. It was a wooden structure before it was into this wall structure. This is where all my this is where my mother, my grandmother, my aunts and uncles attended church when they were younger. Uh, this is the Carrington's Assembly Hall. This is the branch of the Brethren Church. Here at Carrington's Village, St. Thomas. And I'm now going to proceed into Carrington's Village, approaching Sturges. 
Carrington's village in Thomas. Carrington's village approaching stages. St. Thomas. This is my family village. I'm now approaching Burroughs Bottom. Burroughs Bottom is in Carrington's village, St. Thomas. Heading towards Sturgis. Carrington's village, St. Thomas, as well as back down the fetch for Orgley and back to the Vault Road. Next day, no stages. So Thomas. Sturges, Sturges, and St. Thomas. The road on the left leads back to the parish of St. Andrew, where Chapman's village. This is the Judy's Water and Hole shop here. This is the Water and Hole shop here. This is the White and Red shop. The Water and Hole, the Judy's Water and Hole. That's Sturges and St. Thomas. Let's do a walk with all here. And this wall here leads back to Chapman's village. This wall here takes you back to Chapman's village. This is Chapman's village, which is taking you back to the parish of St. Andrew. Yes, yeah. this is Chapman's village, which is now taking you to the parish of St. Andrew. To get into St. Andrew's parish, you have to use the hill to get up. And to get back down, you have to use the hill to get to get back up. You have to use the hill to come up. So St. Andrew is a lower parish. This is Chapman's village. St. Thomas. Looking back at the watering horse shop. Sturgis. Yes, there is Chapman's village in St. Thomas, heading towards the parish of St. Andrew. Yes, this is Chapman's village in St. Thomas. I will take you guys as far as here. This is where my great aunt used to live in this area here. And you can see the hills of St. Andrew from here, which is the Scotland district of Barbados. This is Chapman's village on the border of St. Thomas on St. Andrew. Okay. Going back up the hill now. Chapman's village.
this Chapman village again. Taking you back to Sturgis. The same point to Harrison Scale, Rich Mahal Gully, Flower Forest, and Highland Adventure Center. So this is the road you will use to get into the parish of St. Andrew. This is one of the parishes, which is one of the Scotland district parishes and one of the hilliest parishes as well in Barbados. Now walking back at Chapman's village towards Sturges, we will come across the watering hole, the Judy's watering hole shop. This is the watering hole here. Back to Sturgis, St. Thomas. Sturgis, St. Thomas. Yeah, Pastor Lee. Yeah. That's good. You're right to the right. Need about the Harrison Cave and the Shawn Hall Gully. And the road to the left leads back to Bloomsbury. Back to Bloomsbury and back to the Flower Forest, all in the parish of St. Thomas of St. Joseph. This road leads back to the parish of St. Joseph. That's good. This road leads back to the parish of St. Joseph. But right now, we are in Bloomsbury, St. Thomas. This road takes you back to the Flower Forest, Botanical Gardens, at Richmond Plantation in St. Joseph. That's good. This is the Roman mother used to walk. This is all Richmond, St. This is all Bloomsbury, St. Thomas, heading towards Richmond, St. Joseph. This is where my mother used to walk when she was going by her mother. My mother and aunts and uncles used to walk when they were going to their mother in St. Joseph. They would use this road. This road takes you back to Flower Forest at Richmond Plantation in St. Thomas. My mother used to always use this road to get over to St. Joseph. St. Joseph is another eastern parish and is also a part of the Scotland district. This road takes you back to the Flower Forest, which was once a Richmond plantation. The Flower Forest Botanical Gardens, Richmond, St. Joseph. And it takes you back to Sugar Hill and Mary's Corner, all in the parish of St. Joseph. Looking back at Bloomsbury Road, back to Sturgis. St. Joseph is another hilly parish on the island of Barbados. The only bus that passes this road is the Chalky Mount bus, the one that comes from the Lower Green bus stand. 
We use this road, the Chalky Mount bus. There are two Chalky Mount buses, one that leaves the Lower Green bus stand, and one that leaves the Fairchild Street bus stand. The one from Fairchild Street travels the other road, and the one from Fairchild Street, uses this, this, I mean the one from Lower Green, which is Princess Alice, uses this road. This is the gully here where the bean trees used to be. My remember my aunt told me the stories about the bean trees. This is where they used to be years ago. That's us heading heading towards the flower forest. I will end the video here for now. So I thank you guys for watching. And have a blessed evening. Okay, this is the gully here where the bean trees used to be. I'll end the video here. So thanks for watching and have a blessed evening.